I think we are live. It looks like we are live. Yep, we are indeed live. Welcome again. This is weird. This is the second stream I'm doing today. And it's from a vastly different location than my previous one. <laughs> that was on a tropical island um, in the middle of nowhere. Now I'm in a relatively big city, Miyazaki City on Kyushu, which is a city of roughly 400,000 people or 10 times, almost 10 times as many as uh, all of Amami Oshima. My first um, impression when I when I stepped off the train was like, "Wow, I'm back! I'm back in civilization." Um, so uh, yeah, this will be fun. I basically I've never been here before. Obviously, I hardly know anything about the city, uh, and uh, I arrived literally what less than half an hour ago. Did a quick check-in at my hotel, which is very close to the station. And um, did look a little bit at Google Maps. And it looks like there's kind of an area further down this way that should have a bit of restaurants and things going on. Uh, I need to eat dinner at some point. Maybe we can all eat dinner together if I find a suitable place where I can feel comfortable both eating and streaming. Uh, we shall find out. Um, and I also know that there's one person in the among my viewers who has really requested me to to shoot in this part of Japan. So if you have any opinions or ideas or suggestions where to go, I am all yours. Um, And of course, if anyone else knows anything about the city, you're more than welcome to, to come up with some ideas and suggestions as well. But um, yeah. Oh, thank you, Yeni. Thank you so much. Dinner funds. Very kind of you. What internet do you use to stream on the street? Uh, just uh, my regular cell phone plan just yeah it's a 5g plan but there's no 5g coverage here so it's just regular 4g love the burger you shared in the youtube store yeah that was good that was a good burger that was a really good burger oh you know what actually i want to cross here well, I still can before it turns red. Let's dash. Let's dash. Dash. I think I made it. Um, how was the flight? It was very, very bumpy. Oh my god! It was. It's been a long time since I was. I felt scared while flying, but there was a couple of minutes just as we passed Sakurajima, which is this active volcano next to um, Kagoshima which was there was like a bit of ash coming out of the volcano and then suddenly yeah pretty strong shake shaking it was a small plane so usually small planes tend to shake more um, for those of you interested it was a E170 um, but yeah so so that was like ten, five ten minutes that was really scary just before we landed other than that it was fine um, and then once we landed I found out that the buses from the airport to Miyazaki had been cancelled so I had to take a detour to Kirishima city and change a train there so it took me I arrived here like one hour later than expected oh thank you Stephen for the super chat very dark streets here but I think there will be more activity as we get a few blocks down here yeah str strong turbulence 
especially in small planes that's not nice <laughs> good evening real stage right you're also from Miyazaki we're in Miyazaki again I think you mentioned it before but sorry I, I don't remember no it wasn't a turboprop it was a small jet Embraer yeah less than a hundred seats I think so not a tiny plane but you know not a not a big jumbo either <laughs> Hi Michael. So Michael Hickey is the the guy who is obsessed with Miyazaki. He used to live there and if I remember correctly your wife is from there too, right? Um, so he he asked me to walk to all the way to Miyako no Jo, but that's uh, that's uh, <laughs> a bit far I'm afraid. Um, I passed it on the train though, past your hometown. But uh, yeah. Does it feel good to be back in a big city? Um, I actually really enjoyed Miyako, uh, not Miyakojima, um, Amami, Amami Oshima, but uh, and would have loved to stay a little bit longer. So, no, it's it's okay. I mean, it's nice to be in a city, and it's always exciting to explore a new city. But I wouldn't mind staying a few more nights. Uh, on the island actually. It was really relaxing. Awamikara Miyazaki made kuru no hayai desu ne. Ma, basu, kuko kara basu nakatta no de, Kirishima made basu de itta. Kirishima kara densha de. Demo Kirishima de, but uh, yeah, I hope to go back to the island sometime soon, privately, whenever I feel comfortable traveling privately, because it was such a nice place. Yeah, the area around Miyazaki Station has just been re redeveloped. Yeah, I could definitely feel that. It, it felt super new, everything. I was surprised. It felt... It didn't feel like one of these medium-sized Japanese cities. It felt like more like... I don't know. It felt like a newly developed area in Tokyo or something. Uh, Yenny, yes, thank you. I saw the link that you posted on Patreon. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Privately, I mean not for work. Right now I'm traveling for work. All the trips I've done for the last... Well, since the start of the pandemic has been uh, work trips. So it would be nice to go on a trip. Just as a holiday or vacation with the family. Welcome to Miyazaki. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. a little bit maybe down there I think I see what I guess is kind of a main street this area that I passed now hasn't been terribly interesting but hopefully and it's a Sunday night so we shall see how much life and activity there is
green. Street sign. That's a funny name. II Street. To the Nantoka. Ah, Takashi Shiho. Sorry, Miyazaki Eki, Miyazaki. Tencho, Marubodo. Well, I'm going this way. How's the temperature? Right, so it's significantly colder. Uh, my last stream, I was only wearing a t shirt. Now I'm wearing the same t shirt, which is starting to smell a little bit. Uh, and a sweater and my jacket on top of it so it's uh, it's uh, quite a bit colder here um, yeah 14 degrees 14 degrees <laughs> yeah, weird name. I ice cream street. <laughs> I see you haven't been to your capital city, eh? So I won't be expecting any good advice from you then. I'll just wander around. Let's see if we can get lost somewhere as well. That's always fun. Six degrees cold, yeah. Okay, so yeah. Here, this indeed looks like some sort of main street. And if there's a main street, there's usually nice back alleys to explore nearby as well. So. So this is Miyazaki. Well, the Amami, but... So, as I said, if there's a main street, there's always intriguing side streets. Please eat chicken namban. Is that uh, something that this uh, city does particularly well. Chicken namban, I can eat anywhere. But if it's something unique about it here in Miyazaki, then yeah, sure, I might give that a try. What time is it here? It's uh, a quarter past seven. In the evening. Oh, I like this main street with these really really tall palm trees. Wow, that's kind of exotic. I don't think I've seen a main street with palm trees anywhere else in Japan before. Maybe in Okinawa, but not in a big city like this. It's dinner o'clock. Indeed it is. Indeed it is. I had that massive burger, but that's uh, seven, eight hours ago. So dinner would indeed be very nice. So we'll see. Either I will just walk around with you for a little while, like maybe an hour or so and have dinner after, or if we manage to find a place where I can stream the dinner, we can do it. Should we go down here? This looks cool. 
I like the shape of this Jotun guy. Let's let's go now. This feels like a potential thumbnail as well. Don't food places close in an hour and a bit? Uh, I don't think they close as early here. Because this place is not under a state of emergency like Tokyo. That's why they close so early in Tokyo. This looks tempting. Yeah, I, I have a feeling that there's quite a lot to explore around here. Uh, let's see if it's night. It doesn't say when, what time they close, no. Miyazaki speciality, okay. Seared chicken, ah, sa chicken sashimi. Chicken sashimi, that is good. That is really scary. As a Westerner, it took me quite some time before feeling comfortable about the idea of eating raw chicken, but it's actually really delicious. Chicken is uh, not for everyone. To be honest, I don't know why it's safe to eat here. If anyone knows, please tell me. But uh, basically, yeah, it's quite common here in Japan. And I have had it many times and so have my friends. And I have never heard about anyone getting sick from it. So... Oh wow, I love this taste of brilliance. That is amazing this sign. Let's go down here. Looks like it could potentially be a somewhat shady street. We'll see. In that case I will just turn around and go somewhere else. Yeah, please look into the whole raw chicken thing. Um, it is quite fascinating. Ah, oh, yes, I have such a good radar for this. Of course I found the uh, Yokocho. How nice. Doing shochu. Mm, I'm not a fan of shochu actually. I much rather prefer Nihonshu. Uh, lots of restaurants here. thumbnails it is pretty quiet though as it is a Sunday night Are you still in Amamiyoshima? No. Uh, 
if you read the video description you will know where I am now. Raw eggs are uh, super common in Japan. Uh, we eat it all the time here. And uh, yeah, I have not heard about anyone uh, getting into trouble for doing so either. Yeah, here is definitely a nightlife area, uh, but not much nightlife going on. <laughs> Lots of snack snack bars in this building. Snack bars are these like local tiny bars where you can usually sing karaoke and where most of the clients tend to be regulars. So I think I should probably mm. Maybe I should head back towards the slightly busier areas over here. How safe is it? It's safe. It's uh, it's uh, at least for men. It's generally safe. The only thing that I'm a bit wary about is the fact that I'm filming. So um, I don't want to kind of. Uh, make anyone angry because of that but if I didn't have the camera I wouldn't feel any any discomfort at all uh, walking these streets lots of nightlife area here it must be really nice when it's a bit more lively for women it's not um, it's not as, as safe as, uh, as for men, unfortunately. Um, for women, there's, you know, Japan has, it's, a, it's quite common with sexual kind of uh, abuse in various ways, unfortunately. So. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's getting very quiet around here. So Street with a big sign. But yeah, I will head back to where I came from, to the main street. Yeah, I mean, it's it's generally safe for women as well, but not like I would say for men, it's like super duper safe. For women, there are still bad things that can happen. 
it all depends on what you compare it to though like where you're from and so on but my Japanese friends have many of my female friends have had bad experiences on crowded trains and so on Super quiet here. But interesting to see what what Miyazaki is like. It's a much. It feels like a much bigger city than I expected. That's for sure. <laughs> it's easy to do the trick, indeed. Oh, this looks like a popular place. There's like people waiting outside. Have you thought about making emotes for you? Yes, I have, I have. It's definitely in the pipeline. It's just... Yeah. Life is a little bit too busy. <laughs> yeah, back to the shopping street. I was thinking, let's go down this other direction. Thank you, Unicorn Joe. Yes, beer o'clock, dinner o'clock. I am really hungry. Back here, back at the main street. The main street with the palm trees. Yeah, yes, G-Man AG. I've thought about it many, many times. I was hoping to do it as soon as I, um, you know, enable the membership function. But yeah, a little bit too busy. Super quiet this side of the street. Reminiscent of Osaka. Mm. Ooh. Nice little side street here. Yeah, it's Sunday, so. That's definitely one of the reasons why it's so quiet. This street looks nice too. There's a lot of really nice streets in this city. I will spend two nights here. Uh, but... 
yeah I won't be spending much more time in the city actually I will be doing side trips from here um, all of today and uh, the day after uh, after tomorrow Seems like it's getting more and more quiet here. Mm. And down there is the station where I started the stream. Hmm. So yeah, I'm a little bit at a loss here. Not sure where to go and what to do. It's uh, 7.30, yes, that's correct. At least there's some bars. But that's not what I'm going to do tonight, <laughs> that's for sure. Uh, yeah, extremely empty and quiet. But still, seems like a really nice city. First impression is very good, but uh, kind of wish that I didn't arrive here on a Sunday night when everything is sleep closed. Some, I think art gallery that just opened and then what looked like a very nice bar just across the street from it you can show me the best surf spots tonight mm, not sure if I'm in the mood for surfing right now uh, <laughs> Michael Yeah, I, I feel really lost. To be honest, I don't think it gets much more exciting or interesting than this. So maybe we should just uh, accept that it's a quiet Sunday night. And uh, at least you got to see a little bit. Okay, surf spot here. Um, you got to see a little bit of what this city is about, at least the city center, but um, yeah, I might just call it an early night tonight. I would have a mommy for you, yeah. <laughs> I wish I could and just relax there, take a week off, maybe fly down the rest of the family as well. Uh, but uh, yeah, not a very exciting stream tonight, but at least you got a little tour of Miyazaki City. And uh, I think uh, I might just leave it at that, to be honest. Um, is there any busy, busy place? I don't think there's any busy place on a Sunday night uh, like this, no. Um, yeah. 
yeah yeah i will just uh, wrap it up and uh, have a lonely dinner because i didn't really see any place that felt like inviting to you know sit down and continue streaming um, so yeah i'm sorry if this was a bit of a boring stream but um you can never have like not every stream can be as great as the one i did this morning <laughs> But, yeah. yeah. I think I will just uh, end things here. Yep. Okay. See you then, folks. See you next time. We'll see. Hopefully I can do a stream from a bit more interesting place tomorrow. We shall see. Or another day. Anyway, that's all for tonight. Bye-bye and thanks for watching. Hey, do. Oyasumi nasai. Mata ne.